so hello guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to create a whole environment for gym edits similar to be udavat's editing style many of you have been requesting gym related tutorials and today your wait is over soon i will make a step by step tutorial showing how to edit a gym video in after effect so stay tuned subscribe to my channel and join my telegram group of updates one more thing i will provide all the assets and preset for this edit for free the link is in the description now let's dive into after effects step 1 first create a composition you can decide the ratio and duration according to your preference this is my settings you can copy my setting let me explain i have two clips one with rotor brush applied and another without rotor brush for this type of edit you need to rotor brush your clip first i will skip this part to save your time and keep the tutorial short i hope you understand next we will add a smooth overlay to the composition you can get the smooth overlay from the link in the description select the smooth layer right click go to blending mode and choose screen adjust the position and scale as needed then add another smooth overlay for the ground adjust the scale and position to your liking again select the smooth layer go to blending mode and choose screen select the background clip and go to effect and preset search for the exposure effect and drag it onto the clip use this effect to make the background darker adjust the setting according to your clip sliding or you can copy my setting now add a cold texture image to the composition and place it between the two main clips you can download similar images from sites like freebig i have downloaded this from freebig you can get this image from link in the description right click the cold image go to blending mode and choose multiply then go to effect and preset search for the triton effect drag it on to the background layer choose the same color tone as mine since my laptop is slow i have only 8 gb ram so let's move readjust the exposure of the background layer if it appears too bright select the roto brush layer and apply the dark cc preset the preset is available for free the link is in the description i have skipped the details cc part to keep this tutorial short but if you want complete tutorial on dark cc you can watch this video on my channel i will leave the tutorial link in the description change the color of smooth overlays by applying the tint effect go to effect and preset search for the tint effect and drag it onto the smooth layer and choose color as i am choosing now we will create a snow snowfall effect for that create an adjustment layer on top of all layers go to effect and preset search for cc snowfall and apply it to the adjustment layer watch carefully as i tweak the settings feel free to copy my settings now 
now you can see the bottom part of clip is too bright so we will going to fix that for that create another adjustment layer go to effect and preset search for looks effect and apply it to the new adjustment layer in the look setting click edit which opens the magic bullet looks window add a grid exposure effect and adjust the setting if you don't have this uh, plugin you can join my telegram channel if it's not dark enough add another grid exposure and tweak the setting or you can copy my set background layer is still looks bright for me so i am going to reduce the exposure again once you are satisfied export the video and apply your top edge setting to enhance the video quality if you want a tutorial on using top edge comment of a tutorial i will create one for you import the enhanced video back into after effects and create a new composition to make the video feel colder go to effect and preset tab search for lumetric stops and drag it to final layer follow my subtle changes they make a big difference in the final result your cold environment will and it is now ready thanks for watching guys if you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to subscribe my channel and join my telegram group for more updates see you in the next tutorial